We have a brand new collectible in GTA Online, and it is the Junk Energy Parachute Bag. I'm going to show you exactly how to unlock it with the brand new parachute activities, which Rockstar did mention before this DLC came out. We were going to get these parachute game mode type thing, and this is exactly it. So when you log into GTA Online, you're going to get these little parachute icons on the map. There's going to be 10 different ones you need to complete, and you have to get the gold medals on each one. That's the big thing with this. You have to complete all 10 of them and get the gold medals so that that means you have to land exactly in the center where it wants you to i'm gonna show you a demonstration of one of them so i'm just gonna do this first one right here go to one of the parachute icons on the map and you're gonna see this little junk energy building and then go up to it press right on the d-pad and then we're gonna be high up in there in a helicopter there's the junk energy parachute bag on us right here so let's go ahead and jump and then I'm going to pull the parachute right here. And it's really all about controlling the parachute at this point. If you're not very good at it, hopefully this is some good practice, I guess. Just go inside the circles, press RB and LB. I think it's R1 and L1 on PlayStation. If you want to keep a bit more steady, although you're going to go a lot slower, hold RB and LB or once again, R1 and L1 on PlayStation to go a little bit slower. All right, let me try this again. Hold up. If you mess it up, you can press X or square on PlayStation to retry it. So I'm going to pull the parachute, but when it comes to the blue checkpoints it looks like you actually need to press y or triangle to free fall in them they're not like the regular yellow ones you need to go through we're gonna go ahead and free fall just like that and then we're gonna pull the parachute again and get the yellow ones there's the end of it right down there next to the roller coaster where we see the blue smoke let's not miss this one when i'm holding a or x it's giving me the smoke i'm not exactly sure what that does maybe it makes you a little faster i'm not exactly sure but it looks like we're actually gonna make it in time so i'm gonna hold lb and rb on xbox so i get an accurate landing and i land exactly inside of this thing there we go if you got the little gold rockstar logo thing next to the money that means you got a gold medal on it which is exactly what we want another thing to note is after you complete it you're either gonna get a green check mark on it or a gold one if you get a green one that means you completed it without the gold medal if you got the gold check mark that means you got the gold medal on it and you can move on so make sure you have the gold check mark on each of the parachute ones so shoot bags and then we do have the junk energy shoot bag so it's gonna be all the way at the bottom in parachute bags does look pretty cool gotta say parachute and there we go after getting a gold medal on just one of them we already have ourselves the junk energy shoot bag essentially all you need to know is that you get this junk energy shoot bag after completing one and after completing 10 you actually get the parachute itself so if i go into parachute you can see my primary parachute is just the blue one so basically when you jump off something then you pull the parachute that's what you're going to be unlocking after getting 10 gold medals and it's just going to be a turquoise and black shoot that's pretty much it in my opinion the shoot bag is cooler than the shoot itself you also get an extra fifty thousand dollars at the very end as well after doing 10 of them hopefully this did go on to help you out if you want to see the must-have weapons in each class in gta online click the video on screen now i hope you all enjoy that video and peace